Hey guys, this is Hover. Welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a Korea Loves review just because it is a very popular item right now and yeah, like it's so crazy. I, I just had to get it because there has been so much rave about it and it is the Face Shop Mango Seed of oil, Mango Seed, what is it? Silk Moisturizing Facial Butter and I'm just going to show you the here so you can read a bit. I'm going to zoom in with the ingredients so you can like have a look. I'm not going to list this all over my video so I hope your setting is in HD. Anyway, if you have just paused and went through the list of in ingredients this does not contain silicone so that appealed like so much to me because because a lot of these moisturizers contain silicone and it just fakes you it like it doesn't actually like moisturize you I don't know maybe silicone does moisturize me my skin but it just doesn't feel like it it just feels like you know it just fake does it you know if you open up the box I've been waiting for this moment I've been saving the box for this moment you have this little boxy thingy that you cut out and make I'll do this later and I'll post a picture of it I guess on my Twitter or Instagram and I'm just going to show you the actual product of the facial butter this is part of the new lineup at the face shop of the for the mango seed silk moisturizing line and just be careful there is a facial butter and there is a moisturizing cream so this is not a cream and the cream contains silicone like dimethicone or something so that's why I didn't get it but anyway the rave is about all about this butter so that so this is what I'm going to review so first the Packaging, it is amazingly cute. Look at all these mangoes. I really feel like having some fresh mangoes. It's so freaking expensive in Korea. But the color is amazingly cute. As you can see, it's like... It's so cute. And it has a little lid, which is quite thick. It's, it's quite a sturdy um, lid. And here's the butter. As you can see, I have used quite a bit of it. Um, I've been just trying to see how it goes on my face for um, I think it's been like two weeks now or a week and it comes with a see-through spatula so that's what I've been using I haven't been using my fingers on it I've just been using uh, my spatula let me just show you the actual product as you can see it feels like soft spreadable butter and it smells amazing but I have read some complaints about this smell because some people think it's too artificial and too sweet but yeah so here is the thing I don't know if you've been to Outback you know that um, Bushman bread they they give you as an appetizer and they give you this like creamy butter it actually feels like that creamy butter it's buttery but it's super super like creamy and it is just amazing so it's like it feels like cream but if you look here I mean it definitely looks like butter on the case so I was like this is a very interesting formula but anyway um, as you put this on because it is quite a moisturizing thing it has a lot of like um, moisture so it feels a bit cooling if, if you put like you know really hydrating cream you will feel like a slight feeling of that coolness and as you can see it is super spreadable and it really gives you that silky finish at the end now having used it I spent two days with swollen eyes it wasn't super swollen but it was just so, so just swollen so that my my crease was a little bit more defined which is quite funny I liked it um, but the thing is it stings your eyes it's not strong on the rest of your face I didn't feel that 
but it sting it it did sting my eyes and and when I went back to read the reviews, a lot of people actually felt that as well. But I couldn't give up this product because it's just so nice and creamy, and to me it wasn't that much of a great moisturizer, but it was more like a moisture sealer. So that's where I kind of understand why they came up with a moisturizing cream and a separate facial butter. I would guess that in in dry weather, in dry climate, which we're going to have very soon, which we have now in Korea with the coming of fall, it is quite dry these days. So this on its own, it may not be enough. So if you have a hydrating cream or hydrating serum, you can layer that underneath this and sort of seal that hydration or mo moisture with this facial butter. And because it seals in that moisture so nicely, I have felt a bit of like brightening, if you know what I mean, on my face. If you moisturize your face really well, you see a bit of brightening that comes along with it because your skin has a lot of those water particles. I don't know, it's like light reflecting, whatever the hell that is. I'm not good at science, but yeah. And apparently it has a whatchamacall wrinkle sort of fighting function but I don't really buy it but I guess that's what they say and officially it says it keeps your moisture for 36 hours now right I'm going to have my face unwashed for 36 hours you know so I haven't tested that out but I did feel a bit of drying when I layered this only after my toner so I don't really rec recommend doing that unless of course if you have slightly oily skin or if you have if you even have no normal skin maybe you can try layering this only now uh, I forgot to tell you about my skin type I have a dry skin but it's so dry and lacking in oil that it actually produces too much oil so while my skin is dry it's also oily but it's, it's not dehydrated because I don't lack in hydration I lack in the oil so I have a really like strange um, skin type that I got diagnosed with so yeah but overall I really like this stuff I always apply this avoiding the eye area but I kind of saw that it's good because it reminds me to put on eye cream actually which I always forget so it's a good reminder I suppose but of course this is actually one of the huge downsides about this thing which I just decided to develop into a strong point I guess so yeah and a lot of people have experienced that if they have breakouts due to dehydration using this it was super great a lot of people said that because this keeps your face nice and moisturized it also keeps your makeup last a bit longer on your face I'm not really sure about that because of my skin type I mean it, it just pumps out oil my makeup is just bound to get off at some point so yeah Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram so you can check out what this actually comes out as. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye!